Excuse me. What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a review on the brand new lipsticks from NCLA. Los Angeles. NCLA is a nail polish brand. They are venturing out into other products and they recently released their brand new collection of lipsticks. They are semi matte lipsticks. There's a total of six shades and I'm so excited to swatch all of them for you. Of course, I want to do something super special for this review. So I created this t-shirt for NCLA for my review in general. So NCLA, if you guys are obsessed with this shirt, let me know and I'll hook it up for you guys. So here is my PR box that I received. So cute, I'm obsessed with it. And look at the shiny phrase on the front. Pucker up, girl. Bam! Absolutely. <laughs> Super cute, love the floral flowers on the front and the gold metallic pucker up. Absolutely. So when you open it up, it had a handwritten note. So I want to read that really quickly. Hi, Taval. I'm so excited to share my all new line of semi matte lipsticks with you. I hope you'll enjoy them. XO. Thank you so much, MCLA. And this is the part where I died. They personalized this PR box. I'm so obsessed. Our new lipstick collection, especially for Taval with love from NCLA. I live for this and I'm gonna frame this, it's so cute. Of course, on the back of the flyer it has all of the descriptions of the product and all of the ingredients. And then this is the lipsticks right here, the coveted packaging, inner beauty is great, but a little lipstick never hurt either, absolutely. Six beautiful shades. They are semi-matte lipsticks. They're cruelty-free and 100% vegan, hyperpigmented, paraben-free, phthalate-free, and they are made in the USA, just like their nail polishes. This line of lipsticks are formulated with castor oil. They are formulated with antioxidants, and they also have vitamin E and C in the formula. I feel like it's going to be super moisturizing on my lips similar to lip balm. I don't wear lipsticks that often, but when I do wear lipsticks, I prefer to have some that are going to feel like lip balm on my lips. I'm not really the biggest fan of matte lips. I know that's a huge trend right now, but of course, everybody has their preference with makeup. I just prefer something that actually feels like a lip balm on my lips. So I'm really excited to try these shades out. Like I mentioned, there are six shades, and you can see just right here a little tease of what the colors are going to look like. Definitely more in the red and the pink families. All of the shade names are so adorable and they are basically like inspired by little places here in Los Angeles because the brand NCLA is a Los Angeles based brand. So I'm really excited to swatch all of these colors on my lips. I'm now going to zoom in a little bit closer so you can see all of the shades. Let's start swatching. So beginning with the lightest shade, this is kind of like a peachy coral shade. This one is called Malibu Moments. They smell really, really nice. Super nice light fragrance to these lipsticks. The description of Malibu Moments says, the shade of sky you forgot to look at because you were rolling around in the sand with your Maltese. A bright but soft coral lipstick you can put on before the sunset because why not make every moment a Malibu moment? So here is Malibu Moments swatched on my lips. I love this one. It's definitely more of like a bright coral shade on my skin tone and it's really, really flattering. So I actually want to just swatch a little bit on my hand. I know Jeffrey does hand swatches and I feel like that's helpful to see the colors swatched. So there is the pigmentation of this lipstick. So pigmented and this shade is super pretty. The next shade is the Barbie pink one. This one is called Beverly Hills Bad Girl. I'm really excited to see what this is going to look like this is basically like the only pink shade in the whole entire range this pink is as smooth as a joyride down Rodeo Drive on a weekend when everyone's at Coachella it's the kind of pink that just might fool someone into thinking you're not a total B bad girl <laughs> and here's Beverly Hills bad girl this is definitely very Barbie very very pink let's go ahead and put Beverly Hills bad girl right next to Malibu moments there is one swipe right there. Super, super pretty, and I love this pink. The next color is the red one, and this one is called Hollywood Heartbreaker. You can never go wrong with a classic red, and this one looks like a really nice, juicy, like, watermelon red. So I'm really excited to see this color on my lips. 
How many hearts have you broken today? Sexy but sophisticated, this electric red shade will complement that outfit you bought just to turn heads. Pairs well with Revenge. I love this shade. It's definitely very electric. So good. Like I mentioned, I feel like this is kind of like a watermelon red shade. It's super, super bright, and it's not like one of those like true reds. It has that hint of like brightness to it. Let's swatch Hollywood Heartbreaker right next to the pink shade. And there's that one. Okay, so the next shade is kind of like a darker, vampier red. This one's called Calabasas Queen. So this is probably going to be more of a fall red shade. So if you love wearing red shades, definitely this one's going to be one that you're going to be reaching for this season. So let's try this one next. Calabasas Queen, this iconic red lip is the color from the photo you found of your mom when she was young with the pageant hair and that little black dress she finally let you have. Yeah, this is that red lip. It's definitely that red lip. It needs its own moment. It's beautiful. Okay, so this one's definitely more of a true red lipstick shade. So pretty. Let's go ahead and swatch this one right next to the electric shade. Oh my God. So good, I'm obsessed. The next shade is called Downtown's Sweetheart, more of a darker vampire red. So I'm excited to see what this one's going to look like on my lips. The perfect nighttime red, unless you're downtown. And then it's an all day, bottom of your bag, denim jacket pocket, 3 p.m. drinks, wear it all day red. Because being a valley girl is so early, 2000s, so good. I feel like every shade gets better and better as I go through each one. This one is so pretty. It's definitely more of a darker red shade. I feel like this is more of a fall red. So let's swatch this one right next to the last one. Look at that, girl. Oh, I can't breathe. So here for it. Oh my God, I didn't even think about this. I feel like this is kind of like a posh spice red lip shade. So you know, hook it up. So that leads us to the very final shade and this one is called Silver Lake Serenade. And this is going to be the darkest red of them all. This is more of like a berry tone. So I'm really excited to see what this is going to look like swatch. So let's go ahead and put this one on. In France, they call it aubergine, but in Silver Lake, we call it a basic. Put on this chic eggplant shade before you head out to that cute little place you were going to before everyone else started going there too. I live for it. Oh my God, this color literally reminds me of the Starburst. I'm not sure what the flavor is, but you know the bag that has all the red colors in there? That dark color, this literally reminds me of that Starburst color. Now I want Starburst and I'm hungry, but this color is beautiful, super, super really like berry tone and I live for it. So let's swatch this one right next to the last one. Oh my God, I'm running out of room. Okay, and there is the final swatch. So there's all six shades. Oh my God, I live. So here is all six shades again, swatched on my arm. I love all of them. They definitely complement each other because they are in the same red range family. So there's basically a red for every skin tone. There's a basically a red for everybody. And there's basically a red for any time of the day, any event that you're going to. So cute. All of these shades are available on their website individually. And I believe you can buy this actual whole kit of all six shades if you are in love with all of them, which I totally am. The formula is super, super amazing. It's not dry at all it's so moisturizing it definitely does feel like I'm wearing my own lip balm on my lips which I totally appreciate and I mean look at the pigmentation of these swatches one swipe coverage so pretty so pigmented obsessed okay babes so that's my review on the lipsticks from NCLA Beauty thank you so much NCLA for sending me your wonderful lipstick collection I'm obsessed with them Mwah. all of you need all six of them Definitely let me know what your favorite shade is down below. Go ahead, leave a comment, and make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And if you have not already, hit that subscribe button, join the Savile fam, and I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye. Excuse me.